I'm interested in playing with the format in how people access contemporary dance. The idea of Miss White was really looking about what's interesting for people online to make them want to interact, comment, talk, share. So the character has a, a, a dark side that she tries to um, suppress because it doesn't fit in with her normal facade, her normal image. And I think if you're trying to suppress something, um, it becomes more of a monster than it would be if you let it be open. So it's quite, um, movement-wise, it's quite creaturey, quite low, quite dark. It's really strange for me to dance on my own because I'm used to having another body to like bounce energy off. Just uh, John and I in the in the rehearsal room. It's like you've always got these eyes on you, but I think it's it's quite good for her character because she's always aware of what she, what she's perceived to be like, and I felt like that a bit when we were dancing. For three weeks on Facebook, I'm writing status updates, answering messages basically acting in character day and night for three weeks as Miss White telling the story. As the days go on we see that she's clearly got something quite dark going on under the surface and especially at night she has trouble sleeping and her dreams start appearing on Facebook as videos and they are quite disturbing nightmares. The great thing about telling a story on Facebook online where it's interactive is we get to have conversations with the audience. It is a, it's a two-way, uh, a two-way dialogue. I enjoy working with Ben because it feels like we talk the same language. The great thing about working with Nocturne is that John, I think, wants to do more with video than just document a dance performance. What we're trying to do is create an approach which is almost like remixing a dance performance. The choreographic decisions continue into the video editing stage. I am a Facebook user. I'm sure most of us think we use it way too much. I feel like I'm one of those people, yeah. I'm slightly against Facebook, I'm slightly against Twitter, I'm, you know, not really enjoying how society is moving towards that all our lives is online. So the interesting fact is that it's coming round full circle and I'm using that as a tool. I'm trying to take dance out of the equation, or the word dance, and giving people a visceral experience that they can just happen upon and then make a decision if they want to follow us as a dance company. <laughs>